Yo, 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 what's up, beautiful souls? Listen, so, you know, when I get a prophetic word, you know, um, it's pertinent that I just come and I speak, right? So, I want to first speak on the 750 migrants that sunk, okay, in the middle of the sea, um, which is United Nations territory, I want to then bring up Sodom and Gomorrah and the lack of spiritual moral integrity of humanity, the lack of controlling your free will to bring it to moral standards of the creator. This means attacking depression, anxiety, dysfunction, okay, paying it forward, okay, please thank you, um, ridding your character of uh, low vibrational energy of that of lack of this of um, jealousy, envy, hatred, it is pointless to hate anyone. To be envious of judges of anyone because everyone is a reflection of you, even someone you do not like, okay? And if someone does you, so if someone does you wrong and you hold a grudge, that is your grudge. You understand? The new world of love, peace, and balance, okay? God, we want to love to go to church and be like, God is this, he has no anger or he don't understand no, god created everything there has got to be a balance okay people are so weak spiritually that they're not taming their shadow self so this is leaking out into the government okay as a muse of the most high you have selected few during this time of revelations that are able to reach the frequency of 144,000 access um, a certain frequency. Only 5% of those are muses, which is myself. We hold a connection directly to the Most High. I mean, the gifts of Yeshua and so on and so forth because, because of our purity of heart. Okay. That's been proven through millennia of incarnations. We've been here since the beginning of time. Okay? So we came during this time to help humanity lift their vibrations, which will not take place. The whole humanity will not reach a high vibration when finding God within yourself and finding the true heaven until the year 5023 or something of that matter. So this is going to take a little time. Humanity has been so brainwashed with doctor doctrines, fleshly judgments, not righteous judgment. Okay? We want to hurt each other. We want to sacrifice our kids for money, for wealth. Okay? Not having empathy is starting to show in genes. Throwing off God's plan for new souls to come in and new souls to leave. More murders. Less control. Okay? So souls aren't wanting to come back and incarnate to make the universe better. Okay? Humanity has been living in a 3D level of limited knowledge, which isn't doing no one no justice. We're letting our brethren just die. 750 souls with children. But the government want to play little brother and sister games and put it on the next country. Everyone is at fault here. We have immigrants at the border waiting to get citizenship in sleeping bags or covers or newspapers keeping warm with their children. While we pay $6.5 billion to look for a submarine that, that imploded a couple an hour into 
the explosion. But we have Skid Row in LA. We have hungry families, hungry veterans. Help me make this make sense. Oh, but you can't. Because the nation that claims to be built on the name of God, the Most High. But are you fulfilling that standard? Are we wanting to stop hate crime, division, understanding that this is nobody's lands but God? Who gave you, sir, ma'am, who gave you the audacity to feel that you need to play God and step in the way of another being's freedom that is a direct reflection of you and your child that's at home or in England with your tea and crumpets? What makes them different than you? Open the gate. Spiritual warfare. These unseen entities are attaching to your place of lack. So you have to got to control those drug urges, those sexual urges of which the Jezebel demon leech on to, leeches on to. And you need to pray it away from you. That's affecting many lineages. Stop having babies that you don't love or you just, just want to have kids. That's karma now. And now we're trying to get these kids to freedom and now they die and sunk in the ship. We've got to do better. So let's talk about Sodom and Gomorrah. Can we do our pros and cons? Not just America, the earth, the world, we have more to do. Get out of your comfort zone. It's bigger than what you think. As per my receipts of being a muse of the Most High, there is a council that is against humanity because you guys are so reckless with your free will and low vibration is causing issues. So what are you going to do about it? Why we, the woke ones that are usually bullied and scapegoated, are the ones saving y'all ass. Because we've been able to prove humanity a success. Hence, being ordained and blessed by the Creator because of my heart and my love. That many are not able to do. Let go and let God is okay. <laughs> I send love and light to all you beautiful souls. Hopefully this was an amazing prophetic word. We got to do better. I love you. I say.